This is Dr. Darren Moody with Provo and Spanish Dental Care, and I am giving you the tip of the week. Today we're going to talk about dental emergencies, three of the more common emergencies that happen. Someone gets a front tooth broken or chipped during a, an accident or sporting event or whatever. Another one is you're chewing and you break a tooth in the back, a molar. And then of course there's the big one where an entire tooth gets uh, root and all gets knocked out of the mouth. So the first, if you broke, break a front tooth, you know a lot of that, I consider that to be kind of a cosmetic emergency and sometimes there's pain associated with that of course. So that's something that we'd like to see you come into the office as soon as possible to fix the cosmetic and also any discomfort that may be happening and to check to see if the tooth might be fractured above the gum line. That would create a, a, a more serious treatment and so that's the concerns we have with a, a front tooth that's been hit. Um, and the treatment for that might be something as simple as uh, a very small chip might just need to be smoothed, a, a white filling might need to be placed on the tooth, or the tooth might need something uh, along the lines of a crown. Worst, a root canal on a crown if it gets hit pretty hard. A uh, tooth in the back that, that you're chewing and all of a sudden you fracture a piece off the tooth in the back. Now, a couple of sit situations that can happen with that. The piece may come completely off and ha you know, out of your mouth and have in your hand. You might break something and it's still loose but still connected. That one tends to have more pain. Every time you chew on that, that piece is going to be kind of poking down into the gums. It's going to hurt. And, and that type of, uh, of an emergency drives you to the office pretty quick. Um, but depending on if the fracture was due to just chewing pain or if there's a cavity, um, if the cavity is pretty big and deep, uh, that could turn into a root canal and a crown that could cause even more pain if you don't get in uh, quickly. Um, but the real one, that uh, emergency that requires immediate, within 60 minutes, is when the, a tooth root and, root and all comes out of the mouth of a permanent tooth. Baby teeth, when this happens, we don't reimplant the baby tooth in, into the mouth. That's not a very successful treatment. But permanent teeth, when they get hit and the, and the tooth and the root, everything and all comes out of the mouth, you have 60 minutes to get that tooth back into the, into the mouth. So that's something you really want to get a hold of a dentist to have that placed back in the mouth and then that will be bonded in place for a period of time. Now during that 60 minutes, when you're trying to get somebody to, um, to, uh, to, to, that you can see to get that treatment done, you want to get the tooth and if any dirt, you just gently wash off the dirt. Don't scrub off any, anything because you might have, there could be some pieces of tissue on that tooth that's kind of real important that stays on it. You just, any dirt, you want to kind of gently wash it off in the sink and then place that entire tooth into your cheek. That tooth loves the, the tissue of your mouth. Uh, they used to say put it in milk, but they have found that that's not, uh, you know, really very effective. It keeps it moist. That's great, but the the minerals and the the solution of your saliva is what the tooth lives in. So place it in your cheek and then get to the dentist uh, within 60 minutes. The reason why 60 minutes is, is such a, 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 a critical time, um, they found that if it's before that, the tooth, the body accepts the tooth again quite readily. Most of the time only we'll to have a root canal and crown on that tooth, but as far as it's staying for the rest of your life, it's it, it, higher chances. After the 60 minutes, uh, they have found that within the first 10 years after the incident, your body can actually reject that tooth and start to dissolve that root and, and you lose the tooth. So there you have it. There you have three important uh, uh, emergency events that we, we see all the time. Thank you.